Okay, so if you're not familiar with an ALX, you might want to check them out. I've been looking for a great shaky head rod, and uh, a couple guys I know, they suggested I look at the ALX series, and I tell you what, I've, I think I made a good choice. I picked the ALX Zolo Maestro up for my shaky head, and I don't think I'm going to turn back, at least right now. This is... I mean, it has the power I need. The sensitivity is incredible. It's light, it's durable. Um, I love it. So, one big thing is it's made in the USA. Two, this is a medium light plus, which kind of threw me off when I was looking at the weights of them. But I'm telling you right now, this has the power to get the hook sets and it also has the sensitivity and uh, the finesse it needs to be a shaky head rod. Four to 12 pound test. I'm up uh, eight to 12. So I'm up on the higher end of that. The EVA and foam, or uh, EVA and cork is kind of cool to me. I know some people might not like this, but this rod looks awesome. And also performs so I'm telling you what, if you have not checked out the ALX, you might want to check it out. I have another rod, it's called the Toad Face. It's for a little more power than this, but um, for right now, for the shaky head, I'm going to be throwing this. But hopefully this year, this baby wins me some money. So stay tuned, give me a thumbs up, and comment below if you've used the ALX, especially the Maestro or anything in the Zolo comment and tell me what you think about them if you haven't used the alx rods uh tell me what your favorite shaky head rod is and and tell me what you like about it so stay tuned make sure you're a subscriber and we'll see you out there